What the fuck? That seems bad. Oh, wait. Is there something stuck in here? Hold up. Audio. Music is at... Who even knows? There's no number. What the fuck, dude? What the fuck? That sounds terrifying. What the hell is that? Why is the Christmas video so fucked up and scary? <laughs> oh no. Hang on. <laughs> we have to see. I have to go in and see. When we had last left, the prisoner bound by prophecy. They were continuing their investigations into the informants provided by one Caius Cossidus, Cassides Caius. And so, what did they do but they sought out Mera Milo, a priestess of the Tribunal Temple who divulged some information. However, information was divulged under some degree of duress, for the temple ordinators were ever watchful. Alas, the prisoner did learn of more regarding the Nerevarine cult, but perhaps more importantly from Mera Milo, the prisoner bound by prophecy learned of, <gasps> indeed, the dissident priests, priests of the tribunal temple who rather than going along with many of the teachings, still held on to some of the core values, but instead saw through some sort of potential illusion, a deception made at the highest ranks of the Tribunal Temple. Truly, it was one heck of a conspiracy, baby. <laughs> and so the prisoner sought to report back to Caius with this crucial information and with a cool book, The Progress of Truth. This is The Elder Scrolls Three, Morrowind. This is Morrowind Mondays. And this is also our big winter video. Woohoo! Not like our, not our big big video that we do every year that's yet to come but this is our one closest to christmas which you know hey for whatever reason i just decided a long time ago to do that to do do like a fun cheery little opening <laughs> every time nothing nothing too wild that's that's not until later <laughs> but uh yeah hey wow really snuck up on you anyway let's speak with caius hey I'm all yours. Please, go ahead. Thank you, Caius. Well, if, if you are all mine, how about a little bit about this shit? Oh shit, there we go. Orders. I have your report, and I'll make copies of your notes from Hulia and the Progress of Truth. Give me time to read and digest all this. In the meantime, I'm promoting you to journeyman. You're doing good work. And here are 200 drakes. Go out and treat yourself to a new pair of shoes, and go do some jobs for the guilds or other freelance work, just to keep your cover story current, or get some training. Then, when you're fit and rested, come back, and I'll have new orders for you. Alright, very good. Well, hey, you know what? The game has provided a break in the onslaught of information. <laughs> I guess maybe that's the way that they pace it. Right, the main quest is paced in a way, in such a way that like, yeah, sure, this is the main quest, but whoa there, I'm buddy, waiting. chill the fuck out. <laughs> Let's not do all the main quests just yet. Why don't you go fuck off and do something else for a bit, okay? <laughs> oh God. <Ooh. laughs> something deep within stirred upon seeing that green robe. All right, let's head on over here. You know, I have just the idea, and also, you know what? As much as I do appreciate this wonderful holiday gift from Caius, 200 smackaroonies, holy shit, guess what? In between videos, I treated myself to a little something something. Look at all this money, baby! 35 grand! Oh my gosh, how did we do it? How did we get it? Well, I figured, you know, like I said, 
We, we won't always go through with this little fun trick and whatnot, but hey, just for myself, you know, it's, it's the season and all that. So, you know, hey, we did it. But uh, remember the equipment down in the St. Olm's Canton where we had the Daedric Sword. I went and sold off a whole bunch of that stuff. And who did I sell it off to? Well, none other than fucking Galbadir up here. What do you right? Want? And it took quite a time. I had a podcast going and everything while I did it. So I did the old, you know, buy, and, buy back and sell back trick, you know? Where uh, I bought all of Galbadir's stock and whatnot. And then uh, when the total cost or whatever was really high, I sold off the Daedric Longsword. And I just kept buying and selling back and forth. Ended up getting quite a few levels in mercantile, hey, actually. <laughs> In, in fact, we should rest, right? We should rest before we head on off to my uh, little planned excursion here. Let's see. Care we should also get another dream, right? I'm pretty sure I remember having one when I was testing the levels. Oh, and by the way, also bought, using a bunch of this money, bought training from uh, What's-His-Butt up here to get enough levels in in heavy armor and blunt weapon, I think? Yeah, heavy armor for endurance and blunt weapon for strength. Yeah, okay. Yeah, that's totally what we did. All right, good. And if we rest, we should get actually interrupted twice. Like I said, I, I went and figured it out in between videos. Didn't read any of it, just skipped through it. But alas, you know, we've read it before. Long time ago, though. Anyway, in your dream, a tall figure with a golden mask greeted you, saying, There are many rooms in the house of the master. Be easy. <laughs> I forget his... That... <laughs> this, tall, this tall figure with a golden mask has such a unique speech pattern. <laughs> Be easy, for from the hands of your enemies I have delivered you. It seemed you had died and could see yourself laid upon a table lit by candles. But with your own hands, you touched the figure. And the figure drew breath, opened eyes, and rose from the table. Then the room was gone, and the world filled with light, and you awoke. Ooh, eerie. Okay. It is curious that the tall figure with a golden mask says there are many rooms in the house of the master. Is the tall figure with the golden mask referring to themselves as the master? Because it almost reads as if that is not the case, right? It almost reads as if it's referring to... Uh, without without get going too deep on spoilers, Big L, if you know what I'm saying, if you know what I'm saying, talking about Big L, maybe? I don't know. All right, and we should have to rest once more. Yeah, there we go. You dreamed that a tall figure with a golden mask spoke to you, but you understood not a word. He smiled and seemed pleasant, but when he reached to touch you, it terrified you, and you tried to escape, but you couldn't move. Merry Christmas! <laughs> what a terrifying thing to read on our fun, festive episode! <laughs> Jeez! Oh, man! <laughs> <laughs> no, they're all out of Turbo Man dolls at the store. Oh, I'm terrified. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> what awful timing on this on my part. <laughs> this should have been like the Halloween one or something. <laughs> <laughs> Especially with how badly I played it up as well. <laughs> it didn't even occur to me until part way, like, geez, I'm really hamming it up here for the sake of it being kind of spooky. <laughs> mm. 
You trade. <laughs> wow, great. It gets only worse. You trade. You tried to cry out, but you couldn't make a sound. The figure kept smiling and talking, but you felt sure he was trying to cast some sort of spell on you. When you woke, you couldn't recall how the dream ended. <gasps> Good God. I'm laughing now, but it is partially like a coping mechanism. Like I said, when I was a kid playing through this in fucking middle school, and I, I finally was like, wow, that's weird that we got a text pop up during this. I guess I'll read it. It seems kind of important. I haven't been reading like 75% of what's in this game, despite it being very text heavy. Oh, shit. I'm never reading any more of this game ever again. This is terrifying. <laughs> Fuck. All right. Uh, finally, third time's a charm. Let's rest and we'll get our, we'll claim our special surprise, our fun level. There we go. You have ascended to level 10. You woke today with a new sense of purpose. You're no longer afraid of failure. It sounds like we're very afraid now. It sounds like we're terrified. Jesus, it's a good thing we didn't sleep at Caius's. Holy shit, he'd think that we were having some, like, skooma withdrawals or something. Just, like, ha waking up in a cold sweat or something. Just, like, our eyes completely dilated upon waking up. <laughs> uh, failure is just an opportunity to learn something new. Oh, jeez. All right, let's get five points in strength, endurance, and like I said, we ended up getting quite a few points, or quite a few level ups in Mercantile with all the back and forth I did. So, there we go. Hey, level 10, huh? We probably have enough for bank for, oh no, almost though. One more major minor, and we'll get our level, or our 10 skill up requisite met. Okay, let's see. Okay, I just logged the, the dreams and everything. Oh look, hey, something here. Oh, I almost forgot. Yeah, the next phase of my stronghold should be complete. Which I don't think we meet the requirement for the next part, but we can, we can check. The spymaster took my report and the notes from Hulia and the progress of truth. He needs time to read and digest my report, but in the meantime, he gave me 200 gold to spend and told me to go out and get some guild or freelance jobs or get some training. When I'm back, or when I'm ready, he says to come back. He'll have new orders for me. Great. <sighs> okay, let's do our thing. Should we check this? Oh, no, I did actually. Wonder. Did you want something? I'm tripping balls. Here, should I take this? Do we have the carry way to like lug around a bunch of iron arrows? Hell yes, we do. Let's see. I'll take these just as well. Whew, look at that. We're very near our limit of encumbrance. Very well. Okay. Let's see. So, it, it really feels like we should be telling someone about these dreams. <laughs> With how vivid and fucked up they're starting to get. I feel like we should be reporting to someone about them, but I don't fucking know who. Alright. Let's go. <laughs> Good God, the timing on the on the nightmares <laughs> didn't even occur to me. Like I said, in between videos, I I had been I when I was leveling and stuff, I checked. I was like, all right, let's see if we have enough five points in each one of these important stats to the strength and endurance. Those are the most important ones for me right now. And I was like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Skip through that. It didn't even occur to me that, that we would have to see him during this. Oh fuck, fucking a. <laughs> Okay, who do I need to speak to? Yeah, you over here, with the fancy shirt. Yes, Outlander, how do you do? What's up, Dondo Dryler? Do you want to discuss your stronghold? I do. The improvements on your stronghold are complete. Speak with me again when you need a stronghold fit for a counselor of House Lalu. Oh, I think I do. Construction? How do I, how do I do it? I, I feel like I, I need one fit for a counselor. Although I'm not one, but... I I feel as though I deserve it. <laughs> Am I overreaching? I guess so. Let's see. Man, so how high do we need to be then? 
House father? Because that's not counselor. Right? Doesn't it go up to 90 of a skill point? <laughs> Fuck me. Do we need to, like, seek out the secret trainer or whatever? <laughs> Just dump all my gold into him? Good God. I feel like we're already approaching, however, a point where uh, we're seeing very diminishing returns on our investments in getting our stats up, right? As we're hitting the, like, 70 mark. Yeah. Factor in, you know, high fatigue. Factor in a little bonus from agility. And shit. We may as well be nearly at, like, 80, 90. You know? Shit. That's math. <laughs> Let's get out of here. Let's go over to my secret surprise journey, right? Because, or should we check on the this middling stage of our stronghold? Maybe we should. Maybe we should. Because you know what? I never. We we did check in on it when it was already partially done up. We may as well check again. I don't think they have anything for us, but it'd just be fun to check and look. We can blast some fools along the way. Poor little Sally Scrib. Sorry, friend. I do need the XP. Wow, it, it's like screaming non-stop in death. What the fuck? That seems bad. Oh wait, is there something stuck in here? What the fuck? That sounds terrifying. What the hell is that? Hold up. Audio. Music is at... Who even knows? There's no number. What the fuck, dude? Why is the Christmas video so fucked up and scary? <laughs> oh no. Hang on. <laughs> we have to see. I have to go in and see. Oh my god, it's a nightmare! Oh, oh my god! What the fuck? Why are they all in there? I've never experienced this before. What the fuck? This has never happened to me. Hang on, we should be able to see through it if we can go... <gasps> what the fuck, dude? What is this? There are a bazillion scribs in here. As, among other things, right? What do we got? We got like five Nyx hounds. We got how many foragers? Three, I think, because there's two down there, one there. Three that I can see. Three rats. How many scribs all slamming their asses? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten scribs! All contained within this. What the hell? This is like the Morrowind version of that bird tree in outside of Riverwood in Skyrim. You know what I'm talking about? Oh, you know what I'm talking about? Fuck. The fucking bird tree. <laughs> okay. You know, the, the tree that like every so often the, the birds inside of it would get bugged out and they would just keep screaming at you. Will they come out and attack me? Oh my God. This, why is this video so fucked up and cursed? What the hell? This is supposed to be the cheery holiday video. Oh no. This is a fucking like hellscape. Oh, fucking gross. It sounds so nasty. Holy shit, aren't you glad we came over here? <laughs> you never would have discovered this walking nightmare. How did they get in there? Oh. 
I hate it. I've never encountered... Is that like some weird facet of OpenMW? Is that what I get for updating from uh, point forty six to point forty seven or whatever <laughs> without doing a fresh install? Good God. <laughs> okay, sure. Oh, let's... Let's turn our, our music back on. <laughs> what the fuck? Okay. Cool, I guess. <laughs> wow. I can't wait until the fucking Red Mountain erupts. Holy shit. It can't come quick enough. <laughs> All right. Let's see. They're still out here just chilling out. Good God, I'm like still kind of in shock about it. Absolutely just like slack jawed over the sight and sound and everything. Just all of my senses accosted. I'm munching on this stuff. Sorry. It's all I can, it's all I can do in these times is to eat plants, eat beautiful plant. Oh gosh, every time I get stressed out or full of anxiety, I have to buy a bouquet of roses to just start chewing on. Ugh. There we go. I couldn't even eat any of them, just out of pure, like, panic and sweat. My palms are so sweaty upon witnessing, like, the weird fucking Kwama rock. Kwama Nixhound rat rock. What the hell? Just, like, s having the petals of heather or whatever it is slipping all over the place. I'm like fumbling it massively. It's, I'm like wrinkling it all up. I'm getting like the scent all over my fingers and stuff. There's like a, a weird viscous fluid from it that's coming out onto my f fucking fingers and stuff. Uh, uh, <laughs> what the fuck? Oh dear God. <laughs> what has happened? Alright. Let's go in here. Was this the one that we checked out? Outlander, what may I do for you? Oh there. Clodala Savelle? Have we spoken before? I guess we have. What's our new thing? What new thing occurred? Where I think the story? eggs are new. Here not long ago. Clodala, I should shoot you for saying something like that. <laughs> Good God. Everybody knows in House Lalu, that's the silent part. <laughs> It's fucked up. It's fucked up here. <laughs> Jesus Christ. What a fucking... Fucking house slalu. Alright, up here. Oh, look. Oh. It's stealing if I take these. Wow, there's an ebony short sword, though. Huh. Stealing from who? Oh. Why did I equip the thief ring there like that? That's a little disconcerting. Did it, like, recently get recharged or something? Why, why did it just spontaneously equip like that? I don't... I don't like that. Oh, it's I you. am never too busy for a good talk. Hey, uh, Avron Goals, what's up with you? Welcome, I am Avron Goals. What can I do for you, house brother? Tell me about the great house Lalu. Yes, we both belong to house Lalu. Are you here to discuss business? No, I'm not. I'm just here to look around. Everything looks good. I'm looking around, and I like what I see. It all looks good to me. See, see ya, man. <laughs> What's going up here? Jesus. Okay. Good. Well, let's be off on our way here. Do you think I can whoosh my way out of here, or should I? Oh, shit. Look at that. Let's see. Oh, no. This is resting as well. I mean, I guess we can rest, if we so desire. Rest for an hour. Okay. Let's recall back to Balmora. May as well, right? There we go. Good. And then we'll be on our way to go hunt down what we talked about not too long ago. A very specific and special amulet. Oh shit, it took me back to Curio Manor. Well, that's not great. <laughs> uh, when's, did I get an autosave right there? Whew, thank goodness. Okay. All right. That's fine. That's fine. Here, how about a little bit of what we meant to do 
<laughs> what we meant to do. You know, a little bit of divine intervention to take us back to the temple. Of course. <laughs> the there we are. A little bit of Alcevi intervention to take us back to the temple. <laughs> Oh man, the f seeing the weird rock has fucked me up. It's fucked me up. Good God, <laughs> I can't believe that. That that's that's got to be some facet of OpenMW or whatever, right? Some weird bug from me updating midway through. I don't know. Has this happened to anyone else? Is this just me? What did I do to deserve that rock? I don't- I did just update my drivers. I didn't restart my computer. Am I fi flying too close to the sun here? Is that what happens? I start getting weird fucked up shit? <laughs> Good God. Alright, let's head on up here to... Boop, boop, boop. Oh, shit. Okay, yeah, I'll run. And then from here, I'd like to go up to... Nissus. There we are. Good, and let's wait until it's nice out. So two more hours should do it. Daybreak, eh, we'll do one more. Get the sun a little bit higher there. Good. All right, yes. So we're on the lookout for our big, super cool ultra amulet that makes stealing shit super, super simple, right? I think it's about time we treated ourselves to that. Once again, the gifts keep coming, look. The horror of that rock invalidated the gift of me selling off my earned sword money or whatever. <laughs> selling off the, the Daedric longsword or whatever for big buku bucks. There we are. Sheesh, got him one. All those points and strength are paying off. Okay. Up here. Good. Oh shit. Wonder if we'll be able to see them they're a little difficult and challenging to find right i don't re i never remember exactly where they're at that said hey it's good to get a little lost because we can get some sweet xp oh shit Ooh, that was a well it would have been a hit but there we go good stuff whoa There was a dude up there. Who the fuck was that? Am I shitting off my fucking pants or was there a guy up there? Oh my god, why is this one so fucked up? Wait, who is this up here? Who the hell is this? There's not supposed to be someone up here, is there? I'm sorry? Oh, I see. Okay. Do you normally do this route? Oh my God. It's you. Hey, Nab Salami. Okay. Speak traveler. Holy shit. No wonder I'm not used to, to someone being up here in my last playthrough. This person was dead. <laughs> okay. All right. I'll, we'll save that for another time. <laughs> Good God. <laughs> like, really, like, you know, the hits keep coming. <laughs> All right, let's do a quick save before I just shit my pants while recording a video. <laughs> oh, goodness. Good Lord, I record enough of them. I can't wait. Someday it'll happen. It'll happen. <laughs> Give it enough time. Enough Morrowind Mondays from now. A few, several hundred from now. Holy shit, it'll be a regular occurrence. <laughs> there we go. Who knows? I don't know. Who knows what the fates hold? Maybe tomorrow. <laughs> maybe, maybe the very next one. Oh, jeez. <laughs> what a curse I've made for myself here. All right. The inevitable pants shitting. <laughs> there we go. Look at this! My god, man. Did I turn down the difficulty or something? Let's see. No, we're still at a hundo. Okay. There we go. 
munch on that if we even can. Very well. Now where is our lovely little area? Hmm. Is it up here on the right? Or across the bridge? Now isn't that where, yeah, there's like some witches over there who want to like steal your white snake or whatever. Oh shit. Oh, these a-holes. Pew! Uh-oh. Ah, uh, fuck! Fuck off! Please, fuck off! Jeez! Ah! Fuck! There we go. Okay. Good. It's somehow gotten stuck into a rock. Is that how it happens? Whew. Fucking A, man. All right. Munch on that has no effect on me. Okay, should we restore our health and stuff? Probably. I'll drink at least two of those. Let's get some fatigue going on. Do I have fatigue potions? Eh, maybe I should save them for combat, you know? Maybe I should save them for combat. Let's drink some of these other potions, though. That ought to do it. Oop, stow that before I fire off an errant arrow. Okay, another quick save. Let's see. See, if I if I knew what the fuck I was doing, I'd have memorized exactly where this little pond is. But alas, that's never the case with me. <laughs> Having an idea of what the fuck I'm doing couldn't be me. <laughs> Look, that looks about right up there. That looks kind of correct. There's usually like a kagooty or an alit over here. That said, we may be too low of a level and may be just a nix hound. Okay. I hear something scurrying around. Probably inside the fucking rocks, huh? Listen to that. Oh no. Okay. There we are. Oh shit. Oh jeez. Oh, let me up, please. Thank you. Okay. Take some of that. Lovely. Let's see. How far along is our marksman? Ooh, we're getting there. We're getting there. Look. And is that what I think it is over there? Could that be it, what I'm looking for? Oh, no, wait, that's it right there. That's definitely it. Okay. Let's snipe this thing while we're at it. Oh, my God. Look at that. Wait, who's that up top? Who is that person way up there? Oh, I don't know. Should we go up there and say hello? Who is that? They're not, they don't have any sleeves. Okay, cool. I think they're with a mine or something. Oh, is this the, the dungeon that you come out here for? Maybe I'm just making this up, I don't even know. The Imperial Legion or Cult? Is that what I'm thinking of? Fuck me, I have no idea. <laughs> Shit, how do we even get up there? Without a levitate or something? Oh, here. Okay. Let's go say hello real quick. Should we slay some of the mighty Netch just as well? While we're at it? Oh look, there's Kagooty. Eat your fucking skin like a complete freak. Okay. Yeah, let's slay some of the mighty Netch for a little XP here. We need it. Sorry, mighty Netch. Feel bad about it, but what can you do? Alright. Munch on this. Hey, there we go. How much more... Ooh, we're so close. This one might give it to us, in fact. Can I shoot through that tree? Can I thread the needle? Ooh, I did. Good. Great. Okay, I think uh, that last one was nothing, though. Okay. Look, you know what? I'm saying that it's... 
like, holy shit, making these amazing shots. You know, it's not that hard. <laughs> it's not too hard to, to hit a fucking giant flying scrotum the size of a fucking sports utility vehicle. Come on. <laughs> okay, <laughs> let's go over here. What have we got? All this good stuff. Good. All right, lovely. Okay. Let's blast down there just as well. Oh, shit. Right, because, hey, we're going to eventually need to get this up even higher if this is to be our main one. Right? Save on training points, if need be. Okay, let's speak with this fucking dude. Dude, I'm- I'm- <laughs> Alright. After that rock? No other rocks. I'm, I'm being paranoid about every fucking rock we come across. <laughs> After that rock that we saw, holy shit. I'm open to like, when are we gonna find a rock just full of like, six house freaks? Just a whole bunch of ascended sleepers inside of a rock or some shit. I don't know. I'm open to anything now. Anything could be inside of these fucking rocks. <laughs> Good God. Oh shit. Look at this asshole. Really slow, but packing a lot of power. <laughs> Do you like that? Okay. Munch on that. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit! <laughs> it took me out. Oh, it's so gross. I've, like, fallen down onto my fucking knees. <laughs> Why am I doing this? <laughs> Great. Okay. Oh, look. A fun treasure. Oh, shit. It's filled with nightmares. Okay. Let's rest here. Hopefully we don't get bla- Oh, shit, of course! <laughs> the sweet in all caps. Okay. Here. Let's quick load. Good. Oh, shit, there was a skeletal dude here. Was that not there before? <laughs> was I, like, tripping some major balls? Okay. Like, this is why we've got these potions. Get this going. Lovely. And let's get our probe at the ready. Good. Probe away. And then... Let's start picking. Beautiful. Oh shit. There we are. Firebite club. Pretty bad. I can take it though. I guess I will. I guess I will. Okay. Cool. Let's go over and talk to this person. Whatever their deal may be. Hmm. Where even are they? Yeah, this is totally for the, um, the Imperial cult, right? That's what this is. Yeah, this is so, Din. where are you from? We should, we shouldn't talk to him just yet, right? Because we'll come up here under different pretenses later okay much later but hey look there's some weird fucking rock around him just as well paying it no mind as i snipe a a rat from across the valley okay finally it's time for our prize okay good let's see here should we? I don't. I don't know. How how do we want to handle this? I'm worried that we're gonna show up here and they're gonna beat my ass. <laughs> okay. Let's see. Let's quick save just in case. What can Hello I there, do for you, friend. Sinet Jeline. Well, more. I should be asking you what I can do for you instead. Ah, hello there. I was hoping a. Uh, handsome young gentleman like yourself would happen by. Might you take a moment to help a lady in distress? A lady in distress? <laughs> it is a very nice dress. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I'm in a fucking mood now. Look, after the rock, things have changed. <laughs> this playthrough is never going back to the way it was before. <laughs> We're in a post-rock era. <laughs> Well, I dropped my ring and I can't seem to find it. 
I think it must have rolled down into this pool here, but I can't go in to get it because I'm expected in Nissus shortly. You see, I'm a private dancer, and I can't very well smell like icky muck water now, can I? Would you please get it for me? The water's not very deep, and I'd be grateful and in your debt. It would be my pleasure. Oh, thank you. When I finish dancing this evening, perhaps we can get together and discuss your reward. Oh my gosh. What? You're going to teach me how to dance? <laughs> All right. <laughs> Fuck. I met a woman who has lost her ring in a pond. She would like me to retrieve it for her. Sorry, what the fuck is going on in this video, huh? What's going on with me? What's going on with the game? I don't know. It's a Christmas miracle. I've agreed to retrieve Sinegeline's ring from the pond. Very well, okay. Weird. I almost hear a strange phantasmal noise and perhaps see a strange phantasmic person. Wow, it's really easy to spot this person in the open MW stuff. Okay. <laughs> Hang on, what happens if we talk to him? Leave me alone, Outlander. Okay, goodbye. You're just a regular cloaked chameleon person. Sure. Alright, wow, it's really easy to see the ring too. No <gasps> deed goes unpunished, Ooh. Outlander. Fuck off! Fuck off! <laughs> Oh, no, they're killing me in the pond. I don't remember that audio. That's new to me. Okay. Let's heal up a bit. Great. Uh, what else do I have? Do I have some fatigue? Yeah, let's get a shit bit of... A shit bit of fatigue in us. Great. <gasps> Fuck off. Okay, good. How'd I get a journal update? Okay, thank goodness for like the stunning blast. The knockdown. Holy shit! They're coming in fast! Uh, uh, I got them! <sighs> Fuck you, Tavinu Tadron. Okay, there it is. The Amulet of Shadows. Beautiful. Shit, look at the rest of your cool stuff, though. I can't even haul off all of this. Okay. Nonetheless, hey. Very good amulet, right? Very, very good amulet. 80% chameleon? Typically enough for you to be able to steal almost anything and sneak by almost anyone. Okay. Here, we'll take the arrows. Should we take anything else, though? I don't know. I mean, I guess we could take your stuff and drop it, right? Okay. Here we are. Like, we can drop it. We can do some repairs as well. Get a little armor or XP. Beautiful. Leave this on the ground. Good. Excellent. And let's leave that weapon and the chitin bow. Good. See, this is how... Look, we're just setting the stage for someone playing Dark Souls to come along and get, like, a cool set of armor. <laughs> They're just going to do a bonfire run over here to, to pick up a full set of chitin. <laughs> Fuck me. <laughs> what a deep cut. Okay. Over here. Let's do a quick save. What do you think the crossover is for uh, people who are interested in Morrowind and people who are interested in Dark Souls? I'd say pretty high. I'd say there's a pretty high, like the Venn diagram on that. They're pretty close together. Those circles almost overlapping 100% of the way. Okay. Jeez, you have some nice stuff. Well, <laughs> okay, let's 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 dial that back a bit. You've got some interesting stuff. 
Not quite as nice as the fucking, uh, what do you call it, though? The amulet. Do I want this dire viper blade? It's decent. I'll take it. Look, we're gonna move your stuff out here just as well. Why not? Good. Okay. Cool. Alright. Lovely. Good to finally have that. Oh, we should check our journal just as well. <laughs> okay. Yeah, retrieve the ring. After retrieving the ring for Jeanette Jeline, she and an accomplice began to attack me. It seems this was all a ruse to lure unwary travelers to their doom. Hmm. They should have just stacked all of the killing equipment on the cloaked assassin, right? I don't know. Thank goodness it only went to 80% or we'd be really fucked. <laughs> you know? Jeez. Anything else good in this, like, pond? No. Nothing. Well, I didn't learn how to dance, but I got a really nice amulet out of it. Man, I was ready to do some sexy dancing just as well. Okay. I guess your big hint to that is like, you know, what's the big tourist attraction in Nisus? In Nisus? It's it's the temple, right? It's the, the mask of Vivek or whatever, right? The like earthen mask, the mud mask or whatever it is, you know? Old Lord Vivek's mud mask with the cucumbers and everything. <laughs> I would 100% believe that he would do that. <laughs> I a hundred percent could and, and like the mud mask half of it is like a more reddened mud, right? <laughs> they're they're two different kinds of earth used for the, the mask. <laughs> that that's not how that's not actually how it, how it came to be. There's there's real lore about it. It's like ash or something during some sort of like trek through the wastes or whatever the fuck. <laughs> Alright. Let's eat this little orb. Good. Oh shit, we need to get back to town, don't we? Okay. Quick save will do us just fine. There we are. Travel back through this beautiful countryside in the West Gash region. Looks a little... shitty. <laughs> Probably, if, if I had to pick my least favorite region in all of Ardenfell... Gotta give it up for the West Gash, baby. Gotta give it up for the West Gash. I don't know. I think it's probably the least appealing region out of all of them. Like, what, what else do we got here? What could be worse than this? You get the cool swamps down here. You get the, like, beautiful farmlands and stuff with the Ascadian Isles. Sure, the, it is really fucked up seeing all the, like, slave labor employed in the beautiful like rolling green hills and stuff that's super fucked up <laughs> that so maybe that's the second worst but if we're including not just geogra geography uh the, all the ashen wastes i've come to love them right the grazelands look really cool they look like some sort of uh, uh oh what do you call it oh my gosh what is what is the name of the the fucking like it's a well-known place in, uh, like, the prairie or... What, what, what even is, do you call that biome? I guess Grazelands? I don't fucking know. But in, in Africa, right? It's, it's very much inspired by, like, that. <laughs> and you got the cool mushroom shit over here. You got the, the fun stuff up here in Dagon Fell. Yeah. It's West, West Gash. It's got to be the worst of them all. I don't know. Is there someone who's who loves the West Gash region, who's just like, this is my favorite region out of all of them, right? I don't know. You gotta be some kind of weird sicko if the West Gash region is your favorite of all the Vardenfellian regions, right? Jesus. You gotta be some kind of a fucking pervert. Jeez. <laughs> all right. Let's go on up here. Or down here, even. Good, good, good. That said, if I remember correctly, it's alright. 
in in ESO. It ain't half bad in ESO. You know? A few hundred years removed and a completely different engine with completely different gameplay mechanics. <laughs> yep, yeah, it's alright. But I would probably still say my least favorite of them all. Yeah, thinking about it. Okay, well, holy shit, we're back in town. <laughs> I suppose when next we come back, I don't know. <laughs> Maybe we'll, we got our shit, right? We can check back up on our stronghold and everything, you know? Yeah, we can check up on all that. We got some stronghold stuff to tend to. Very good. Look at that. Look, we worked in some freelance work, just as Caius recommended. You know? Look, <laughs> there's our pacing. <laughs> all right. And... Uh, when next we come back, we'll take care of all that. And also, the next video, if you know, you know, it's going to be a little special. Just a little. Just a little. Anyway, before we close things out, of course, every year, I like to do this because I'm just such a fucking sucker. All right. In addition to our usual closing, I hope... That you ha look, I even wrote it down every year. I gotta write it down, or else I'm gonna forget. I can't keep track of all this. I'm an idiot. All right. I hope that you have had, or will have, or do have all all tenses, past, present, and future. I hope that you have a happy, wonderful, merry, fantastic Christmas, Hanukkah, Kwanzaa, Solstice, Walid, Boxing Day. Rahatsu, Pancha, Ganapti, Omisoka, Yule, and of course, a Festivus for the rest of us. Please, take care of each other.